Paho, Mamma Mia, it's a me, Mario. And welcome back to a Gator Sniper playthrough Super Mario Sunshine, where the super exciting boss cliffhanger continues, and we can continue fighting the giant horrifying eel with uh, these super great fucking controls. It's actually not too bad once you get used to it, it's just you actually have to like circle the control stick around to turn. Oh hey, he turned as soon as I was turning. Or she? I don't quite know. It's probably both. It's both. It's like both male and female. Because look, see, it's got four eyes. Two of them are manly eyes with big old scary eyebrows. While the others have some pretty, pretty eyelashes. Or, you know, maybe the fucking thing just identifies as like, I don't know. For, you know what? Oh, oh no, hold on. We don't have time to fucking assume this thing's gender. We, oh god, we're gonna fucking face the social outrage of this beast on all the fucking social medias. Alright, no, this is fine. Alright, good. Good to go. Fucking eel. Calm down with your shit. I'm sorry, I, I made some assumptions. I just wanted to, like, have a clear focal point of, like, what we could, what we could fucking talk about here. And I can see now that I was wrong. I was wrong, Mr. E. Mrs. Uh, the Zay Eel. The Zay Eel. That actually sounds like a fucking fantasy beast. The Zay Eel. Or maybe a sci-fi. I think I see it more as a sci-fi uh, cr creature. What's going on here? Can I just have some air? Oh, oh lord. Oh god, I, I despise this right now. Hold on. We gotta, we gotta do some, we gotta do something about our current situation. Mario, please turn. You know what? I don't even fucking care. I'm just gonna go over here. Fucking air pockets or air bubbles. I, I need some coins. Coins are better than air. Who needs to fucking breathe when I got money? Money I can pay for for air. Oh, yeah. It's like that Hunger Games shit where they have, like, the sponsors. I just pay for someone to send me, like, packets of air and fresh, uh, fucking, pa like, containers. Kind of like a Kool-Aid pack that you just stick a straw into and then air pops out of it. And you're like, yes, this, this is what, this is what, uh, nature intended for us when we just, we finally were driven to the point where we have to make our own air. It's actually more like that thing from Spaceballs. For those that have ever seen Spaceballs, it is, like, um... It's like a m mediocre movie, I guess. I don't know. I loved it as a kid, but then I watched it again recently. It's like, oh, well, this is just like, this is kind of, kind of dumb. It's like Family Guy quality, which probably is going to cause some fucking arguments about what Family Guy quality is. But uh, we'll just fucking leave that be. But uh, yeah, no, it's Spaceballs is kind of like, I don't know. Spaceballs was okay. I enjoyed it a whole lot as a kid. I, I probably still get some laughs out of it, like, thinking back on it, but... Oh, I don't know. It was just... Watching again was just kind of rough. I was like, oh, oh, this was my comedy as a child. It's like, at that point, I'm like, oh, yeah, no, we're definitely, um... Uh, we're definitely gonna have to work on some things here. Which, that being said, eh, not, not really so much of that has been done. Working on my comedy, not, uh, not really one of my fucking main priorities in life. Yeah. Oh god. He's popping off with all these air bubbles again. Alright, dude, I, like, I, I get that you're upset. I get that you're upset with your current predicament with all the fucking cavities and whatnot, which I'm doing a, a superb job of cleaning, I have to say. I'm not even really causing you pain by doing it. Like, I'm actually fucking, like, this is probably the nicest way I could be doing this, except for the fact that your teeth literally are falling out, which I hear is a nightmare among some people, where they have just, like, the, these dreams of, like, all their teeth falling out. It's pretty horrifying and whatnot. This is, like, actually happening for you, but I'm sure it, you're fine now. You're fine. This is, like, the cleanest way this could have been done. Thank you for the, the golden tooth. Ugh. Yeah, and go back to where you came from. Oof. It wasn't so bad once, like, I could actually see... Like, once it got, like, a little less dim once I got bad here, I was like, okay, this is this is not so bad. But, uh, yeah, like, oof. I'm not, I am not a fan of, like, the deep water. It's just, like, when I can't quite see. That's when, that's when I have a real bad time. You know, let me just, eh. Yeah, I wish I could, like, flip these things upward so I could swim down fast and then just slowly sink. Where are my iron boots? For my Legend of Zelda style iron boots. There we go. Good job, Mario. You've done your family proud. Whatever family you may have. Oh, yeah, Luigi. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, I forgot Luigi was Mario's brother. Luigi and Gooigi now. The canonically added twin. Oh, man. Great. I've always wanted there to be an even weaker willed, slimier Luigi than what we already had. I'm super happy about that. Alright, well, now that we're here. Let's go, I guess we'll go back to the fucking Pianta Village place. I wish there was like, actually maybe there is one, I don't know, I'm already here. I wish there was like one of these rockin' alls just a little fucking easier to get to over there. Or like, I don't know. I feel, uh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of like, 
something not stupid to say here. It's that thing again where I'm like, what they should have implemented in this game, and then I'm like, what the fuck does it matter? This game's been out for like 50 billion years. It's literally older than the dinosaurs, and yet still has superb quality in my eyes. Except for when you do fucking underwater maneuvers and you realize, like, it's fucking ass. That's a real bad time. Oh, and I guess while I'm also here, I could try and clean off the little shine sprite doohickey. That'd be an easy way to get a star. We'll save that for later. Once we're actually, like, about to beat the game or something. Thank you, me. Thank you for this quality. The quality that I've always come to ex expect. What the fuck? What the f- How did I get down here? What the fuck? Holy shit. How did I do this? I've wound up in some secret compartment. Oh, no. Oh, God. Is there, like, a way I can get back up to where I'm trying to get to? <laughs> okay. Wow. I think I actually just fucking clipped through the ground and just found this. That's, uh... That's different. Little do you know, that's the only way to get this particular blue coin. You have to clip through the ground in a weird area. Hold on. How do I fucking get out of here now? Where's the nearest, like, sewer panel? Oh, God, it's like a whole fucking maze down here. I've actually stumbled upon the secret maze labyrinth of Delfino City. That was weird, man. I Fuck me. All right, cool. That's one of those things that a speedrunner could probably do. If they, like, know how to fucking recreate situations like that. I mean, I say that, but I also don't really know, like... I don't know. So here's what I understand from that aspect of speedrunning. Uh, you need to, like... You basically just need to know where you're going, and then you have to figure out ways to clip through certain walls. I know corners are, like, pretty good with that whole thing. Like, if, if you're able to, like, clip yourself through a corner and walk through the map, you can basically just circumvent a lot of mazes. Like, in Skyrim in particular, a lot of those, like, dungeons where it's, like, just a kind of, like, a long stretch of, like, going through fucking tunnels and shit. You just no-clip through a wall, or you plate-clip through a wall, because one of the specific ways I've seen it done is just with a plate. Uh, you just clip through the wall, and then you walk where you want to go. It's crazy. I love watching the kind of speedrunner shit. Also, we have this asshole. It's me, El Pentissimo, and now listen, see that flag all the way over there? I can see it, because I have super awesome vision. What do you have? You just have a fat Mario belly. What are you going to do with that, hmm? Now you and I shall race to get there the fastest. Yes, my personal record is 30 seconds. 30 seconds? God damn. Impressive, eh? Are you at the ready? Then get set and go! I like how he gets a little bit more of a head start than me. Really enjoy that. Oh god, I need to remember all the fucking, all the ways I can cheat. Here we go. Here's my favorite. Oh man, I don't, I don't think I got this. I don't think I got this, Mario. I am sorry, you gotta cut the corners, and then we gotta... Fuck me. I, it, it's my fault for just trying to fucking run past him. I need to do this shit. Oh no, he fucking, he hit, he hit me. Il Pantissimo hit me. He cheated. Even though I ran into him. Alright, fine. We'll fucking try it again. You're nothing but a rank amateur. Come now, dig down and show me what you have, mustachio. I will be waiting when you're ready to try again. Until then, let me take your life. Jesus. It hurt Mario so bad, he lost a life from it. Just straight up death. Do I get sent to the beginning of the stage? I go back here. Please, I hope I'm at the top. Please don't put me back at, like, the starting. Oh, thank God. Okay. Yep. Flat on your ass. All right. You gotta remember my fucking maneuverability moves. Fucking Mario. I know it's me, but it's easier to blame Mario at times like that. So, I gotta do the fucking slide dash, but there's got, I mean, like, what's the fast way to do it again? Pretty sure it's just, like, you mash B and A, and you just kind of fucking, ooh, slide on your belly all quick, like. I hope so. I hope so. Let's fucking try it. We'll try it on this bridge. The ultimate testing ground. So, just like this, and then, okay. Okay. That's a good way to build up speed. Unless I start going uphill, which had been my, my fail, my fail failing grace there, yeah, and if I talk to him from here, I'll have an advantage of uh, being a foot ahead of him, which actually probably put us at, like, a fair start, because I notice he, he gets a little bit of a head start on you. Little asshole's just, like, cheating right from the get-go, just like, yeah, like that. All right, here we go. Whoop, whoop, whoa. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're getting, we're getting momentum. Oh, he's copying me. He's a fucking copying loser. Whoa, you can't catch this action, though. This hot fucking action here. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, we got this. He can't fucking catch up to me here. I think he is naturally faster than me, but if I keep doing hops like this... Yeah, look at that. Look how fast I am. Fast little fucking tubby Mario. Oh, I beat your record by four seconds. What do you got on that? Wait, who am I talking? Am I talking to her? Nice job. Wow, you must be tired. Thanks. 
Okay, neat. I thought El Pantissimo was gonna talk to me. All right. Doesn't he normally award me the sprites? Hey, dude, how you doing? Ooh, that's all I have to say to you. Now be off. All right, f I, we're tied. Just be like, oh, wow, well, you tied with me. Good job. No, you have to be a dick about it. Gotta be all like, fuck you. How dare you beat me at a race that I challenge you to. <sighs> His fault for losing to a fucking tubby, middle-aged, fucking Italian man. Like, seriously, Mario does not seem like the epitome of health to me. Seems like he should be, like, I don't know, he's probably a little tuckered out after a race like that. I'd say more than a little tuckered out. He's gotta move all that belly. He's gotta be, like, he's gotta have, like, like the th fucking calves and thighs of a Olympian god. Or, I don't know, something along those lines. Uh, shit, and what do we do? Do we just keep doing these missions, or do we try and fucking, uh, like, spread it out a little bit? I'm thinking about going to the lighthouse. I think that's a beach. Let's go to the beach. What's going on in the beach this time of year? This time of year. I love just, like... There's a thing with me and talking where if it goes on for too long, words just become a slurry, a slurried mess of like, how are, how are these words being mixed together? Like, how are you saying this word here? Like, it's it's amazing, really. Oh, Shadow Mario after. Oh, this is like the last mission, too. That's right. Every stage ends on a mission where you gotta catch the Shadow Mario, which is absurdly easy. Like, all you have to do is like, chase after him and spray him with some juice. Some, some fucking delicious, delicious juice. Here, we just gotta do this, too. It's, like, easy. I mean, he, he's a little fast at times, a little flighty asshole, but it's really, like, it's surprisingly not bad. Like, for a final stage, it's like, oh, wow, okay. I guess it's, like, frustrating, especially if you're a kid, like I, like I am, where you're just like, oh, I can't keep up with him, and he keeps, uh, and then he does shit like this, and you're like, oh, whoa, 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 he's flighty, never mind, he's got evasive maneuvers. Good job, Shadow Mario, all right. I, it's the thing where it's like, if I could actually lose at this, I'd be like, oh, sh ow, he fucking flip-kicked me. All right, well, maybe I can lose at this if he deals enough damage to me. Here, just, uh, fuck, my oh, Shadow Mario, good lord. Oh, good, now the camera's caught between the fucking chasm. I love it. Thank you, fucking Mar oh, hold on, let me walk a mile away so I can actually face a camera through here again. Oof. It's like that thing where I'm... Did he jump down there again? Fucking damn, where did he go? I hear him. I hear him making noises. Uh, oh, there he is. He's over here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, no, like, if he could actually kill me... Oh, damn. I saw him over here. Where'd he go? Oh god, he's, he's gone away from me, I suppose. Or is he over here? Oh, there's a rocket nozzle. That's good. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Ah, I saw a flash of blue and I thought I found him. Hey, this is how you lose the stage. You just give up because you're like, where did he go? I hear him. I swear I hear him. It's like a phantom fucking hoo-ha on the wind. Where the fuck did he go? Phantom hoo-ha on the wind sounds like the title for some fucking romance novel, by the way. The Phantom Hoo-Ha. There he is, you fucking asshole. Get back here. Yeah, I'm spritzy you with all this water. Like a bad fucking cat. Help these bees don't chase after me. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. If I could, like, fucking target lock, too, that'd be great. Another one of those things is pointless to say, because it's like, yeah, no, the game's, the game's out. Let's just do the fucking try and true strategy. Just let him uh, tucker himself out. Fucking, fucking take a, a long fucking artillery shot at him. If he would fucking hold still. Like, I get the whole purpose is he's not supposed to hold still, but I'm still gonna complain about me having to fucking catch up to him. Hey, dude, where'd you go? There you are, you little fucking asshole. Just gotta... Uh, uh, there we go. That was, uh, that was adequate. That has some amount of damage dealt to his, his system. Alright, where'd he go? Is he behind me again? Uh, I see a bur... <sighs> oh, he's fucking sticking his tongue out at me. I can hear it. This is a little asshole. Oh, there he is. There he is. Little fucking ass. Get back here. Good lord. And now he's... Okay, he's over there. Good. Ugh. Like, it is act. Oh, whoa! Okay. Oh, that was a fucking mirror again. I was like, what the fuck? I was just about to complain about the camera, too. Yeah, like, I've, I've said it before. The camera's fucking ass. It's a real bad time. Like, it's... it's Like, when it gets caught between things, it's just so frustrating. It's like, I would love to look where I'm trying to get to, but instead my camera's hanging out over here with the palm trees. I'm trying to fucking see what's going on. I have to use, like, a pr like preternatural senses to fucking know where Shadow Mario is at times. Especially, like, around here. Around here, he's especially hard to find until he does some shit like this. Uh, yeah, and then we just hope that we're hitting him right now. Cannot see him for the life of me. Mario, Shadow Mario, and Mario, you know what? You're at fault here. Surely it's not the player's fault. Surely it's Mario himself. Oof. And it's this point, too, where I'm also like, 
think I questioned this before about what the health system was like. I hope that he doesn't, like, regenerate at all, otherwise this is never gonna end. Like, it's the thing where if I could lightly hold the trigger, God knows I'd be abusing that to hell right now. Because I'd be using it to actually, like, get consistent damage on him instead of having to, like, hold still and then tr uh, get a shot off like that. I have to do this. This is what I have to do, and it's terrible. It's horrific. It's the worst way to try and shoot a Mario. Ah, he fucking hit me again. That's against the rules. It's like a foul. It's like a, what do you got, a red card. This is like soccer, right? This is some amount of soccer. I mean, it's like if there was professional tag. Like, th that would be against the rules to hit the opponent. Which actually draws me to my next query. Why do we not have professional tag? Professional tag would really, re really spice things up. Great, and he's gone the other way again. I gotta restock on water too soon. Man. Alright, where'd he go? Where is it fucking at? Is he over here? Oh, I hear him. Where'd he go? Fucking Shadow. Oh, wait. I heard him over here? Shadow Mario. Where'd you go? I hear him. I hate the fact that I hear him just like somewhere. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Alright, well, let's fucking look around here again. Man, it's at times like this where I'm like, God, I love it when that fucking episode has to end on me being like, yeah, I guess we'll fucking finish him off. Oh, next time. There he is. Hold on, we'll get a couple more shots. Oh, the fucking sand. I forgot about that. I remember having a weird fucking fetish for that, too, as a kid. Like, jumping from high distances and having Mario sink into the sand. It's like a feeling of helplessness. It's like, mm, nothing gets my, my little kid self off quite like that. Alright, fucking Shadow Mario, just fall over. Alright, alright, Shadow Mario. You know what? We'll call it a draw here. I'm gonna end this episode so that we don't have to watch this for another five minutes of me chasing after Mario and refilling my juices. So yeah, this has been a Gator Sniper playthrough. See you guys in the next one where Shadow Mario is fucking dead. Later, everybody.